even if 120 megahertz of the 294 megahertz allocated for broadcasting were freed up as a result of an incentive auction, a healthy and robust broadcast system would remain, and we want a healthy and broadcast, uh, robust broadcast system to remain, and nothing would change the terms of use of a six megahertz channel, including mobile DTV. Some have argued that we should wait up to a decade or more until a new broadcast transmission standard is adopted. I note that other broadcasters have argued against moving to a new standard. But in any event, we don't have a decade to wait, and the transmission standard issue is separate and distinct from incentive auctions, which, as I said, don't affect the transmission standard for the six megahertz broadcast channel one way or the other.